Okay, this is in response to, uh, to this video here about the missing data on Google Sky. So I took the same coordinates and I put it into Google Sky and of course I came up with the same thing. There's a big missing piece of data on Google Sky. Uh, and this is the center for the coordinates that are given about some image that is supposedly from this area here that shows something strange that they're trying to call Planet X or Nibiru. Um, so with that missing data I then went to my software put in the same coordinates and this is what I got here right there is where that is and I put I put this uh, one degree box around the area just for a reference for size for me uh, go to Google Sky it also tells you down here at the bottom the uh, the reference for that how large of a piece of sky you're looking at so I went to the digital sky survey put in those coordinates and selected a 30 arc minute field of view and I got this here which matches up with my software there so we can bring them all up together. So here's the Google sky in the middle. This is the point we're talking about here. Here's that star that they're talking about that was split in half when it was cut. There's the same star over here. You can see the star here and then there's some little stars that come down down into the right from it here. It's the same thing here. There's the star and the stars that come down into the right. So, the area that is, it's centered on in the missing data in my software, it is here, and then it has three little stars in a row here. Over here on the data that I pulled up from the uh, Digital Sky Survey, there is those three stars in a row, and then the spot they're talking about is just above it. So, nothing really there, just a... Uh, just a star. Um, I have no idea why Google Sky would be missing that data. We'd have to ask Google why that is. Maybe there was a uh, something, a comet or a uh, a satellite that passed over that area during the time that they took that photograph, and. Um, seems like they could have replaced the data by now. I don't know why they would be leave a big gaping hole like that. Um, of course that's going to raise a lot of questions in people that are paranoid about the government. Uh, I also here's a here's a picture that I took of that same part of the sky. And let's see if I zoom back the Google Sky. There's there's Orion. So we're going to go from uh, from this little star down here in the corner and then there's the spot that they're talking about. And in my picture, so here's the star in the corner, the bottom left knee of Orion. And if I go up, there's that next star. That's 55 55 Orion and if I continue on the area that they're talking about is right in there there's those three little stars in a row there and I don't know some stars there nothing spectacular so there's the big gaping hole the Google Sky left. Why would they do that? No clue, but I doubt it's anything sinister.